hi guys welcome back to another tutorial video in this video i'm going to show you how to create a pixel stretch effect like this in affinity photo all the photos that i'm using in this video are from Asplash. if you want to download it just click on the link in the description okay so without any further ado let's get started okay so i suggest you to choose some photo like this that shows the entire body of the object okay so the first step is to separate the object from the background you can use any tool that you want I will use free and selection tool to select the object. Okay, some tips for you. When you select the object, make sure to select a little bit inside of the edges because when you apply this effect, if you select the outside part of the edges, the outside part will be visible and it wouldn't look so good. So make sure you select a little bit inside. But on the other side, it's okay to select the outside part of the edges because we only apply the effect to one side only. Okay, and after you have done with the selection, mask this layer. Then press Ctrl D to deselect and then duplicate this layer by pressing Ctrl J. So this one is for backup in case we need it. And for this one, I'm going to right click on the mask and then release mask, then merge them. Okay, after that, I will resize the canvas. I'm going to make it wider and I'm going to create a new background for this photo I will apply some gradient overlay Okay, then the next step is we're going to use marquee rectangle tool and select some part of the object like this. Just some part of it like this and then press Ctrl J to duplicate the layer and use move tool by pressing V. Then stretch it out like this. Okay, so what we did was using rectangle marquee tool to take some part of this body as the color and then stretch it to create this pixel stretch effect. Okay, and then move the effect below the object layer like this. And it will look like this. Okay, do it until it covers the whole part. Okay, so we need to stretch it until the end of the canvas. And after that, select the, the effect layer, all of it, and press Ctrl Shift E to merge all of it into one layer like this and then we're going to delete the part that we don't need and then next click on the effect layer and click warp tool this one mesh warp tool then i will make it looks like this To add a new point, just hold Ctrl and click on the line to add a new point. Okay, so we'll make it look like this. And after you have done, 
click apply and again delete the part that you don't need and then the last step is to add shadow to make it looks more realistic so I will create this new exposure adjustments and make it a little bit darker like this then press Ctrl I to invert and use brush tool I will use this round like brush and make sure the foreground color is white oh but before that it will be easier if you select the edges first then use brush tool and pan over the area that you want to add shadow like this and it's done so this is the final result and that was how to apply this pixel stretch effect in affinity photo okay so that's it for this video i hope you enjoy and learn something new from this video hit the like button if you like this video don't forget to subscribe if you have already and i will see you guys in the next video